Nicole's got your mobile geeks and here we are at Mobile Asia Expo 2013. I'm checking out the Vivo X-Play. This is a 5.7 inch smartphone uh, and it's running the Qualcomm Snapdragon 600 processor. Its display is actually pretty impressive. It's 1080p. Let me just pull up uh, the photo gallery here. Let's, actually, I'm having some trouble navigating with one hand. So why don't I pull up this awesome little widget over here where I can navigate around the entire device single-handedly. Totally love this. Uh, they've actually packed this with a ton of features. So let's close that small window off. Uh, it comes with an augmented reality app that I'm pretty fond of. So let's see if I can get this going for you. There we go. So you see there with these photos, he's talking to us. He can play with his phone. There's, I think there's around uh, 50, you said, right? 50 photos that, the, that this happens with? Yeah, a series of 50 photos. So there's another one there. Oh, a little bit of glare. There we go. And you can see if I pull back, it actually does multiple photos at the same time. It's kind of nice to see that they've included this uh, augmented, augmented reality feature within the handset. There's a few more in here. Let me just find uh, this one back here. Let's choose uh, Shanghai since this is, where we, oh, this is where we're at. So you can see here. They've included some 360 action here. So this is a China-only handset. So uh, the Google 360 stuff isn't available here. So it's quite cool that they've made the effort to pack it with a whole bunch of its own features. So this is only available in China. It's around uh, 2,900 yuan, which is around 470, 480 uh, US dollars. So they have their own ROM on here, which you can see. There's a nice little sliding widget there at the bottom so you can turn on the Wi-Fi and stuff. Uh, if we take a quick walk around the system, you can see that there's the SD card slot there. Around the bottom would be a micro USB. Around this side, the power button and the volume rocker. At the top, we have a two megapixel front-facing camera. On the back, a 13 megapixel shooter with LED flash. Now, if you check out the back, there are, there are dual speakers on each side, and this is uh, anodized aluminum here with a combination of plastic, so we won't have any antenna issues. So I'm pretty fond of this, uh, this, this device. I mean, I like that they've packed in a whole bunch of features. I especially love that they've done that one. You know, natural single-handed motion on a 5.7-inch device. So only available in China, sadly. Um, but I'm Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks at Mobile Asia Expo 2013, taking a look at what's available in China.